Hello YouTube, LD50 here, but another video and today we are going to further the story with OP10 Deputy Salvador. Uh, if you have seen the previous two episodes, you'll know that we've made it all the way from the southern shelf uh, and we will be proceeding as far as Sanctuary and maybe even as far as the Firehawk today. Uh, here's the build. And we're currently rocking the Grog, Grog Nozzle, Orphan Maker, uh, a Lady Fist uh, for swapping for the extra 800% critical hit damage, uh, Evolution, Gunzerk uh, Com, uh, Deputy's Badge, and Longbow Stormfront. Though I may change that to uh, something else. I think I might change that back to the Longbow Slag Singularity. It's a low level one. Um, because we can use that for crowd control uh, when we get up to the raider camp up there where we've got to get the part for the uh, catcher ride. So, we'll move swiftly forward. Sanctuary's off limits. You bloodshots can stay in your hole. Right, we'll uh, proceed forward. This machine will digital and we'll go and clear the camp out while uh, Scooter's uh, rabbiting on. That's the camp cleared out. Nice and easy. Just attach the adapter onto the catcher ride and I'll get you a free car. <laughs> Executing phase shift. And we'll swap over to the um, afterburner because we will be using a car now. Down. Must remember to ch uh, change it back when we go back into combat. Take a, a trip um, uh, past so this save station here on the off chance that we've had a savage lease spawn. Doesn't look like it. We'll catch up when I get back to sanctuary. For now, I need your help. 
My men tell me Corporal Reese hasn't returned the power core that we need to keep the city shields running. Bring Reese back to Sanctuary, and you'll have earned your place in the Vaders. Roland's contacted you? Good. Listen to what he says. He can help us defeat Jack. Oop, and let's go and meet Corporal Reese. I know that Savage Lee can't spawn here until we've uh, been to Sanctuary, but he, I believe he can uh, spawn at the other point uh, prior to that point in the story. So it was worth checking. and get the call. We might as well uh, achieve the optional objective here and kill all the raiders. Because why not? It's definitely sour. Nice fucking hit a crit. Team. Got a few more to get. Oh, there we go. Happy to oblige. I'll give you everything I've got. Both barrels of the orphan maker. The last one is over there. Lovely. Go and pick the power core up and we'll make our way to Sanctuary. That's the power core. Great. Jack won't destroy Sanctuary today at least. I'll get back to the city. We'll meet up once I get there. Uh, let's put the uh, Fable Tortoise and the Raider Com combo on just to give us a little extra speed. Get back to the car. Oh, and I forgot to put the uh, Deputy's Badge back on when I did that combat. So, even without the, the uh, Deputy's Badge, we were had no real problem. This 
is a message to Sanctuary. The last stronghold of the Resistance. Pandora as you knew it, the Chaos, the Bandits, that time has passed. If you let it, this could be an era of order. Thieves! Just turn yourselves in and I promise, your deaths will be quick. Roland, is that you? Oh, it's the Vault Hunter. Hey, you like my speech? I was lying about the last part, by the way. I'm gonna spend a lot. Right, there we go, made it to the Sanctuary without um, too much bother. So I think we will go on and meet uh, Junkie Lilith, the Firehawk, with her Iridium uh, addiction. Uh, uh, made it to Banditville, huh? Well done! It'll be nice to see a friendly face when I'm burning that place. You're the one Commander Roland was talking about. The one who faced Jack and lived. Look, we need your help bad. But first things first, plug that power cord to the shield generator. Right, must remember to uh, take that weapon off because we only want the three weapons uh, attached. Uh, I can always sell it, it's worth a million. And must remember to put our deputy's badge back on. I'll keep the raider and fable tortoise on because we're doing a lot of running around at the moment and not much in the way of combat. Right, hurry up, come on. Yeah, you better open that door. Commander Roland never came back from the secret of the specific orders from this contingency, which you can help carry out. Go meet with the town mechanic. Crap. I mean, uh, And there are a couple of small um, side quests to take care of in Sanctuary. Uh, the one with Marcus and the one with Dr. Zed. Just so that... Um, we don't have to trigger the cutscenes in those areas every time we go in. Oh crap! Is you that peering? I heard all of you were robots and you eat metal out the garbage and stuff. Knew you wired death machines be come for me once Roland went missing. Now if you're here to kill me, you should probably know. You'll never take me alive, you robotic stone bitch! Now you gonna help us out with this Roland situation? I heard them Crimson Raider dudes talk about it. Roland told me if he ever disappeared, I was supposed to initiate Plan B. Or as I like to call it, Plan Turn This City into a floating house fortress of airborne awesomeness. Ha <laughs> ha! B. I, I got some fuel cells around here. You'll need those. Oh, and you'll need this uh, iridium here too. Uh, to be fair, we don't need the iridium. We're at, we are at max iridium. You're gonna need a third, which is why I gave you that here red rock. Uh, you can buy the last cell from Earl's Black Market. Careful though, Earl's crazy. Uh, he ate one of my cars once. Yeah, the whole car. Just back with a fork. Roland said we could. Don't worry, nobody's gonna turn you in. You're our only hope of stopping Jack. Thanks for grabbing all that stuff for me. Third degree burns are best taken in shifts. Now, to see the fruits of your loins, this city's gonna fly! Or not. Damn. Well, now we really gotta find Roland. You know what? Maybe get to Roland's place. I think he might have left a message there for you. Could I have a refund, please? This gun doesn't seem to work. Hmm, I don't know. <laughs> Looks like it works to me. Okay, let's get this little side quest done. Get over it. Hey! If you 
you're gonna be a part of the Crimson Raiders, you better know how to use elemental weapons, don't you think? I just got a crate of spanking new Malawan elemental weapons. Wanna help me test them out? Now, haha, <laughs> fire and flesh. Quite a nasty combination. This Hyperion fascist thinks he's safe because he's take that, Jack lover. <laughs> A few good hits from a shock weapon. Hmm, now what else? Armored targets like these damned Hyperion rope. Now let's try out these new slag weapons. Slag is a bit more complex. If you slag your enemy, all not now that he's slag, he should be easy enough to finish off. Switch to another weapon and hit him again. Great! The weapons work, and you're ready to take on. If you want to purchase any... Elemental weapons like these, you could always buy some from a friendly neighborhood arms dealer. Yeah, all right, Marcus. Uh, we'll you just sell that um, quest reward weapon that we got. And uh, we'll sell that as well, because we don't need that. And we'll go and see. Oh, I don't know if we can see Zed before we've actually Walter, gone in. Get in. Roland left a message for you. I think we might actually have to go in and do the safe bit before Zed will give us that uh, that quest that he has. Hey, soldier. If you're hearing this, I'm in trouble. Right now, you're the only thing standing between this city, hell, the whole planet. If you're wondering what all the Tunguskas are for, that's for us to uh, sell city. later on. You can use it to store anything you need. This is your home now. Good luck. Because uh, ammo is very expensive at OP10. And uh, whilst we won't need pistol or shotgun ammo, we probably will gr need grenades at some point. Oh, crap! It's Firehawk's got him. Roland's in deep. You gotta get Frostburn Cannon and rescue his ass. This is if Roland has been captured by the... Right, we'll do this little Zed quest as well, and then we'll go to do the um, Firehawk quest. He's in danger. You're the only one who can stop Jack, but Roland is the man with the plan, so to speak. He knows the best way to strike at Hyperion. Look at boys caught this Hyperion jerkbag trying to sneak into the city. Looks like they messed up his lugs. Dude needs surgery bad. Get over here. You're gonna be my operator. Assistant. All right. Yeah. In just below his sternum. We don't want a nigga to our... Oh, didn't check off. There you go. Close enough. And a radium shard. All right, let's go and see Tannis. How many times I tell you it is. You can't get slack powers by swallowing this stuff. Oh, that shard. As I've said, Roland, now that Jack has the vault key, it is only a matter of time until he opens the vault. Also, I require a new ventilator. This lab smells of bacon. Bacon is for sycophants and products of incest. No good in the black market. It didn't refine yet. You could probably take it to that tannis lady. Come on back whenever you need some healing. As <laughs> long as you ain't scared of a little tetanus anyways. All right, let's go to uh, Frostburn Canyon. And let's uh, put our afterburner back on. And while we're here, we'll make sure we change uh, back to those two. <laughs> And we'll put our deputy's badge back on. 
Oh, what do we get as a uh, quest reward there? Tedio recall. Absolutely useless. Okie dokie, Frostburn Canyon, here we come. I'm not going to kill all the enemies, but we'll just uh, make our way swiftly to uh, to Lilith. Gunzerk's nearly back anyway. The Firehawk should be around here somewhere. Stay alert. That's weird. The Bloodshot Bandit Clan seems to be attacking the Bandit Clan. They probably left landmarks for their reinforcements. Those should lead you to the Firehawk. That or just follow the screaming. Step off, Vault Hunter. This is between the Bloodshots and the Firehawk. Again, Deputy Sal making trivial work of all the enemies. Somehow we've managed to pick up uh, a weapon, which is uh, have to avoid doing that with uh, Deputy Sal, because with Deputy Sal, obviously we only want the three guns, because we want to be able to swap between uh, Lady Fist or Grog Nozzle. Let me explain something. Even if you do rescue Roland from this Firehawk guy, the Crimson Raiders ain't exactly along for this world. You know what? I think you deserve it. Oh, oh, your pathetic oh, assistance died. And he loved it. <laughs> A lot. This is it. 
Firehawk's hideout. I need a powerful woman! Right! Yeah! Do it! Okay, let's go and see Junkie Lilith. Oh, you feel that? The sound of those let's get a couple of grenades while we're here. Might be useful for crowd control. That's the sound of progress, baby. Look out! Burks! You're going down! me the Firehawk, but the name's Lilith. I'm with the Raiders, like you. I keep the bandits in line for roller control to take down that. Anyway, long story, lots of internal bleeding. Could you help me up? Oh, I need a pick-me-up. Yep, I'll Who's go and get you drugs for you, Lilith. Appreciate it. Oh, thanks. Bet you're looking for Roland, huh? He's not here. The bloodshots grabbed him. Made him cocky, too. They never came after me this hard. They're in here! Get them! <laughs> now the real fun. I'll see if I can't phase blast a few of them for you. Don't you steal my kills, Lilith? the way live I can't see anything thank you, How are you doing over there? Lilith no help at all Get some ammo. this ain't over yet they found another way in let's drop it well done
fun. Feeling tapped out though. Could you give me another hunk of iridium? All right, I'll get you some more drugs then. Junkie Lilith. Yeah, that's the stuff. Give it here. Thanks. Uh, yeah. Since the vault opened, my siren powers have been getting a little awesome. Thanks to this iridium stuff. No idea why. Now, let's talk about rescuing my boyfriend. Well, X. Before the bloodshots arrived, Roland was getting intel on the vault and what Jack plans to do with it. You have to find him. I gotta head back to Sanctuary and keep the city in one piece while Roland's away. But first, I'm gonna teleport you into the bloodshot stronghold. That's no, you're not. You're Roland. gonna teleport me a few You'll feet. Catch him by surprise and have a real advantage. It'll be great. Hold still. I just moved you like 10 feet, didn't I? Great. Still getting used to this. Reminds me though, bloodshots. Ah, uh, put our combination oh, so speed combination back on. Might want to train a bit before you take them on. Yeah, we're already OP there, 10, Lilith. Like we don't need up. to train at all. Fuck you. And we'll take that uh, to sell at the shop. Money? Right. I'm actually going to go back to uh, Sanctuary. Unless this guy's going to give me a hard time. No, but I'll kill you. Right, okay. Let's get back to Sanctuary. There we go, uh, Max Money again. From a um, from a financial standpoint, OP10 is quite easy to play um, because whilst everything is quite expensive, even even green uh, weapons sell for a decent amount. Uh, oh, we got that one to get rid of as well. Make sure that we get rid of that. Let's just get this out of the way. Yes, most of my merchandise was ripped from the hands of dead adventurers. I see we're at max money, so we'll just unequip it and we can sell it next time we uh, we buy grenades or something. Okay, so I think that will do for this segment of the playthrough. Uh, I'm going to change back to uh, this and that. Uh, just so that we're ready to go when we pick it up again in the next episode. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this little segment of Deputy Salvador. If you have, please leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel. It'll motivate me to keep going. Um, and I'd like to think that you'll come back and see the next episode when we will push forward. Uh, we'll probably do some other side quests as well. I'd imagine we'll do the uh, Assassinate the Assassins quest as well, seeing as it's available. And we might do a couple of other fun ones uh, before we progress the story too much. Anyway, uh, I've been LD50, you've been lovely, and I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.